What is up guys, it's AJ Brook Reviews here and today we'll be looking at an early LEGO Minecraft set. This is LEGO Minecraft 21260, the Cherry Blossom Garden. Age range is 8+, plus, comes with 304 pieces and retails for $28 USD. So this set's supposed to come out June 1st, but I got it early at my local Walmart, it was on shelves. So I had to pick it up. Now let's see what's inside. As you can see here, we have the back of the box. You do have all the play features listed and another view of the Cherry Blossom Garden. You also have two thumb taps. So we're gonna get that opened up and then we're gonna see what's inside. Then when we open the box, we have one, two, and three number bags and we have one instruction booklet. So we have two figures in the set. On the left, we have the character on the box whose name is Sunny. And then on the right here, we do have this normal zombie. The zombie is nothing special. We've gotten him, feels like a gajillion times. And then our Sunny character does have some uh, extra printing on the back and she is holding a silver hoe. As her tool, I do like her little, you know, robotic or metal or gray arm, whatever you want it to be. I also do like her headpiece. So now let's look at the mobs. Some of the extra mobs included in the set include two bees, which we've gotten plenty of times before. It's a basic bee build on a clear antenna piece to get the you know, flying motion. Then there's also the sniffer egg here, which is a pretty basic build, a bunch of one by one tiles and bricks on a two by two brick or plate and then we also have our first baby sniffer first sniffer builds in lego this is, our, this is a baby sniffer very small compared to a normal sized figure and the only thing i don't like about this is the detail is not really any printed bricks it just looks very basic as you can see nothing special about it but what is special is this large sniffer this is our first time getting a adult sniffer in lego as well as a baby one like i said earlier and there is a one by two printed tile on the nose, some one by one printed bricks um, on the side here for the eyes. Definitely more detail than the baby one. Uh, nice playable feature, which we'll get into later with the nose. And yeah, overall, it's a very large build. As you can see, here's a normal size figure sitting next to it. It's pretty big. Uh, and I do really like this build. Like, this is a really nice sniffer build. I think they knocked out the park here. And yeah, let's get to the build. Here is our build. We have a little uh, little outpost or a little campsite for our figure, and we do also have some nature incorporated into it. So let's get into it. So right here we do have this little stone path with a large cherry blossom tree. Very beautiful build. We have some flowers on the side. You do have a little bridge made out of some uh, pink brick. It could be wool, cherry blossom, whatever you want to imagine it. Uh, we have a little bridge there for our figure. Then we have this little fenced in area with a torch and some bricks here. You could pretend um, you could be whatever they want. Uh, it could be wool or, you know, I don't know what this brick is though. Uh, I'll say that I do not know what that brick is. So let me know in the comments uh, the, where the torch is. That could be wool or whatever. Again, whatever you want it to be. Then moving to the side here, we do have some more flowers, another cherry blossom tree. And then we have our play feature for the sniffer. So what our sniffer can come in and do, since it likes its seeds, it can put its nose up in this block right here. And then all you gotta do is press this green, green center area of the sniffer and the grass piece comes off because sniffer does like seeds. As you can see, there's a, a plant down there. It could be some seeds in there. And that's what sniffer likes. So it's gonna come in and lift up the grass. It's a really nice play feature. And you can do a lot of it. You can have a lot of fun with it. You know, using having a zombie up on there, having the character, Sunny character up there. You can do a lot with this play feature, and I really like it. And you can do it nonstop. It's not like it's gonna break or anything. It's very durable, so you can come in and boom, like that. That's what I really like about this set. That is a main play feature. And now I'll take the instructions and my final thoughts. Now our instruction booklet is uh, nothing crazy. It just have your normal instructions in it. And there is you know, a brick list in the back, but there is a little advertising here for some other summer 2024 Minecraft sets. You have the Badlands Minecraft, the Wolf Outpost, the Village or the Windmill. Also have the Pirate Ship, the R set right here, the Cherry Blossom Garden, and then you have the End and the End Ship. So it's very, overall, it's a very nice set. Uh, only thing I don't like about it is it's $28. I definitely don't see why they could just made it 25 or even 20 if they wanted to give us a really good deal. And another thing is that this sniffer is very large and it's going to have a hard time fitting with all other 
uh, people and figures and mobs on here so it is a pretty big build but in the large minecraft world this is a definitely this is a definitely nice build but it is a bit big um but yeah 20 dollars definitely could see being 25 or even 20 but overall it's a pretty nice set you get a for build for the first time in lego minecraft and if you want to experience your world i definitely recommend getting the set make sure you guys like comment subscribe and i'll see you on the next one